The Phenom has arrived. An ominous feeling has entered the air. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Brothers of Destruction from Death Valley, weighing in at 309 pounds, one half of the Raw Tag Team Champions, The Undertaker. The best pure striker in all of WWE. The Undertaker is most certainly someone you don't want to cross because he holds grudges. But if you can somehow make it out alive against him, you just might earn The Undertaker's respect. That's a very big might. Moments away from doing what he does best, dominating the competition. This is his yard, and there's no turning back now. No mercy. Are you sure there's no turning back? Here comes our Tribal Chief. Perhaps the most dominant champion in WWE history. The head of the table, Roman Reigns. And representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, Roman Reigns! I've been at this table for decades, and I've never seen a competitor this dominant. Month in, month out, Reigns continues to dominate. Oh, yeah. yeah, but think about this, Corey. The man who finally puts a loss in Roman's record will become immortal. It's bold of you to think he'll even lose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, even with the competition at this level, you might be right. You just can't help but be in awe of the Tribal Chief. I agree, Saxton. This man has truly earned his spot at the head of the table. And he is truly the Tribal Chief of WWE.
And from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the Rock! No rest for the weary amidst launching movie franchises, owning a football league, launching countless products, and so much more. The Rock truly does it like no one ever before. It is always a special moment when the great one comes home to WWE to lay it to smack it down. He's the trailblazing, eyebrow-raising phenomenon. The great one, ready for action. straight out of a nightmare. Yeah, but that seven feet, 300 pounds of real life flesh and bone built for destruction. The big red machine ready to make the ring his ghoulish playground. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure Kane is planning to take sick pleasure in doing so. It's Vader time! And from the Rocky Mountains, weighing in at 450 pounds, the man they call Vader! Fared at home and overseas, one of the greatest competitors in Japanese wrestling history. Yeah, let's not forget he has stacked championship gold all over the world, Michael. Well, Vader's definitely more than worthy of his Hall of Fame enshrinement. As unforgettable as he is, intimidating. And he's ready to dominate again tonight. You can bet that the Mastodon has a massive Vader bomb locked and loaded for this matchup tonight. Yeah, it doesn't matter who you are or how big you are, that move will flatten you. Gentlemen, it's time to have a nice day. And from parts unknown, weighing in at 287 pounds, Mankind! Mankind responsible for no shortage of historic moments in WWE. Uh, who could forget that fateful night when Mankind was tossed from the top of hell in the cell in 1998. And Mankind hasn't been the same ever since. But then again, Mankind did introduce the world to Mr. Sacco. You illustrated my point perfectly. Mankind seemingly takes pleasure in feeling pain. Yeah, well, that does not bode well for anyone in the ring with Mankind tonight, or anyone at ringside for that matter. Ladies and gentlemen, we're ready to get this match started.
kick to the midsection prevents the attack. Textbook jumping clothesline. Oof. Look, the most intelligent competitor in a battle knows that there are many roads to victory, including the low road. Swinging neck breaker. Just a nasty headbutt. Being able to pull that off, no one is going to question if you skip going to the gym today. And he goes for the pin. And now Kane. And he breaks the count quickly. He couldn't make much of that pin attempt. Ooh, nice hip drop. We'll have to scrape him off the mat after that. Uh oh And he's able to fight Kane off. Oh, what a DDT. Wow. Stiff headbutt. Hey, you can't do that. There was no issue with that attack. Hey, sometimes desperate times call for desperate measures. Who are we to judge? It's obvious that mankind's trying to inflict as much pain as possible with that attack. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Oh, and that well scouted. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. The Rock reminds us all once again that we are watching the most electrifying man in sports entertainment. Mankind with a nice reversal. Good golly! Caught by surprise with that clothesline. Oh my god, a clothesline! Saw it coming. Oh my gosh! He must have had that scouted. Will this be enough? But now we see Mankind. Surprisingly quick kick out. Just power out. Dragon screw. Oh. Ooh, nice hip drop. Bringing down all of that weight. Nothing but malicious intent. Setting up for something here. Driven down face first. There's a lot of hard ways to land, but that might be the hardest. Roman Reigns so dominant. Guillotine applied. And there's the save. And he's out of there in a nick of time. Double underhook into a DDT. He keeps his team in the match. Now it's The Rock. Up they go. Oh, atomic drop. Sleeper hold cinched in deep. Fading. And bam! Oh, Reigns! Will that slay the Mastodon? This match continues. Backbreaker. A snap there by Roman Reigns. Stop at the stop at the stop. Position here. Oh, 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 just bounce that face like a basket. 
Harper. And he's able to counter. Mankind shows the world with that.